Hi, welcome to my video tutorial about how to rearrange the whole iPod menu. Okay, first you have to get iPod Wizard, the latest version. You, you can get it on iPodWizard.net. So, um, you have to load your iPod terminal. It's a course, you have to do this. And now we go straight to the Layouts tab. From a drop down menu, you chose Menus. Okay, when you want to change something in the music entry, you go to Resource 2444 nil. Um, the important thing, um, the things you have to change and swap is the set file and the layer uh, in the comment. And um, when you want to know what you're going to change or what, you, what to change, um, you make a double click at text ID2. Then you will see, ah, uh, playlist is the first, second is artist, and this goes on through all text ID2s. Um, okay. I've written down somewhere the comment and the set advice. It will go faster this way. <coughs> okay, we start. Make a single click at the comment of playlists. Then mark decimal and type in the comment of artists. Um, this is and click on change value. Okay, value changed successfully. Now we go on. At the artists comment, single click to, and we type in the comment of playlists. Click on change value. Okay, value change successfully. Now it's going to be a little difficult. Um, you have to go to the set 5, make a double click at the first one. And you will see it's highlighted one in the, uh, something in the hex box. Um, now you you take the first four blocks and um, type it in. But you have to mark hex first. I think we can set 5 and type in the first four blocks of the hex box of artists in the um, playlist plan. One. And click change value. Value change successfully. And now this goes on for the artist entry. This would be the second set five. You type in the set five of playlists. And click change value. Okay, value change successfully. Now just write it to your iPod. And you're done. Just safely remove now your iPad from your computer and let it boot up normally.